And it is Child Abuse Awareness Month here in Nebraska, and organizations are taking steps to combat this issue, including the Bridge of Hope. Our very own Andre Brooks has more. It is Child Abuse Awareness Month here in Nebraska, and organizations across the state are tackling this hard-pressed issue. This includes North Platte Bridge of Hope. According to Bridge of Hope, the child abuse numbers in North Platte has decreased between 2022 and 2023. However, in 2024, the numbers have gone up and Bridge of Hope's response to these numbers are concerning. So, um, around the COVID years, like 2021, 2022, those years, we, we did see record numbers here going over 400. And 2023, um, we did thankfully see a little bit of a lower number, um, but still quite a few children. We saw 366 cases in 2023, and we are on track to have actually more than that this year. This year, 2024, just from January um, up until today in April, we've seen 117 cases. And the human trafficking numbers have gone up between 2022 and 2024. This year, we've already had a few human trafficking cases. Um, in those cases, you know, we all take really seriously. Um, we it takes a, a lot of team to you know work those cases and try to do what's best for those kids. And there are factors on why this is happening. Um, you know, a lot of times around the holidays, there's a lot more stressors um, and a lot of parents that are um, struggling and trying to cope with the stress of the holidays. It really depend on the time of year, what we're, what kind of cases we're seeing. The Bridge of Hope over the years have come up with a plan when it comes to child abuse awareness, and that includes outreach and education on child abuse. So we're, we're really trying to focus on education. When it comes to our community outreach um, and Child Abuse Prevention Month, we're trying to educate, you know. Um, I believe it truly is an adult's job, an adult's responsibility to help keep kids safe and preventing abuse. And, and you too can be an advocate. The Bridge of Hope said all you have to do is call them or visit their website, bridgeofhopeac.org. Reporting from the Bridge of Hope, I'm Andre Brooks. News 2. And as North Platte continues to